Hey, gentlemen, these women are out here voting, getting jobs, and they're getting a little too comfortable. I think it's time to reel them back some. No more abortions. I, does it really make sense for us to be telling women what they can do with their bodies? Boy, if you don't shut your dumb ass up, anybody have any real reasons we shouldn't do this? What if somebody is assaulted or they don't have the means to care for a baby? Maybe the contraceptive failed. Hey, but what if I'm cheating on my wife and one of these chicks gets pregnant? How do I get rid of the evidence? <laughs> Johnson, Johnson. They're women. Who cares? <laughs> You're right. <laughs> now all we gotta do is take away their right to have jobs and they really won't have anything to argue about. Oh, y'all are sick. Misogyny. I'm looking at this list of pros and cons of why abortion shouldn't be illegal. We got rape, incest, contraception failure, not cut out to be a parent. And on the list of pros, we got saving babies, but it's scratched out. It does sound like there was an error there. I was assuming that was because you're forcing people to have kids that they don't want and not assisting them in any way afterwards. Well, you're not wrong. So save the fetuses, but after you're born, fuck you and you can be shot up at a school? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, and is it true that a woman also voted yes on this? Hey, Bill, this Negro thought we were listening to the vagina person like she's not married and following what her husband tells her to do. Look, we're trying to get it back to the good days where you Negroes was in the field, you could punch your wife in the mouth. She didn't have an opinion and these gay people didn't exist. You black. Actually, I have reverse vitiligo. Watch your tone, boy.